Hello. Hi, teacher. How are you? Good evening. Good evening. Okay. Can you hear me? Yes. No problem. No, no problem. Okay, then. Uh, All right. Okay, good. How was your day, Brenda? I'm fine, teacher. And you? Okay, good. A lot of work or not too much work? Oh, good. Hmm? So, so? Yes. Okay, that's good. Hey, hello, Flor. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. How are you today? Good, teacher. Perfect, perfect. Okay, just... Uh... Now we're going to start. Okay, and where are the others? Just let me check because the, you're gonna get me to share the the platform. This is module one with you. Okay, here we go. This is about families. Just to this level. Okay, good. So we have Iris, Carmina, Robert. Oh, Robert is here today. <clears throat> then we have Vlog Floor and Beatrice. Okay. Let's see, we're gonna, now we have this platform ready. Okay. So we have the, the, this is the last section that we were introducing last night, remember? We were talking about the, <clears throat> a conversation about families using the present progressive or present continuous, right? So the things that we are doing in this moment or things that are happening these days. Okay, so it's a interesting topic. No, we're not ready. Here. Your family, I want you to play the conversation. I'm practicing in class. 
Asking about families. Part A. Listen and practice. Tell me about your brother and sister, Sue. Well, my sister works for the government. Oh? What does she do? I'm not sure. She's working on a very secret project right now. Wow. And what about your brother? He's a wildlife photographer. What an interesting family. Can I meet them? Uh, no. My sister's away. She's not working in the United States this month. And your brother? He's traveling in the Amazon. Can you tell me now where Rita's parents live? What do they do? Type your answers in our discussion box. Page 31. Exercise 3. Part B. Listen to the rest of the conversation. Where do Rita's parents live? What do they do? So what about your parents, Rita? Where do they live? They live in Texas. Oh, where in Texas? In Austin. It's a small city, but it's very nice. Are they still working? Oh, yes. My mother is teaching at the university there, and my father is a carpenter. Are they still working? Oh, yes. My mother is teaching at the... Where do Rita's parents live? What do they do? Okay, remember we answered this last night. Where do, par uh, where do Rita's parents live? What was this? this Texas? Uh -huh, Texas and the city? Austin. 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 Yes, it was in Austin, right? Austin, Texas. And... So what about your parents, Rita? Where do they live? They live in Texas. Oh, where in Texas? In Austin. It's a small city, but it's very nice. Are they still working? Oh, yes. My mother is teaching at the university there, and my father is a carpenter. Okay, what does the mother do? What does uh, Rita's mother do? Her mother teaches Teacher. at the university of yes. Austin. Yes, she and, teaches at the university. Uh -huh. and, and her father is a carpenter. And her father is a carpenter. Very good, okay? So mother is a teacher, father, a university teacher, a professor, right? Usually in the universities, they call teachers, they call them professors, right? But then they, the action is teaching. And the father is a carpenter. Okay, that's good. My mother is teaching at the university there, and my father is a carpenter. That's correct. Okay, good. You see, that this is what they are doing, right? So they are teaching, my father is a carpenter, they are living in Texas, so they are using the present progressive, okay, to, ex to talk about families. Uh, next one. This is the word power. Look at Sam's family tree. How are these people related to him? Write the answer on the spaces provided, right? But first, we're going to take a look at the family tree. Okay, so we have the family tree. It says, look at Sam's family tree. How are these people related to him? Add these words to the family tree. So we have cousin, father, grandmother, niece, sister-in-law, uh, uncle, and wife. Okay, we have here grandfather. Then we have mother, aunt, a husband, okay, husband, and brother, okay, you have brother, and then we also have nephew, okay, this is the nephew, <clears throat> these two, all right. Questions about vocabulary? No questions, teacher. 
No questions? Okay, good. So then, next to grandfather, what do we have? Then Andy is the grandfather and Martha? Grandmother. Is the, grand, is the grandmother, right? So then these two, this couple, they have two children. Okay, two children, uh, Sara and Manuel, right? Sara, uh, let's say, is the mother, is the mother of Sam and Jim. And Chris? His father. Father. Uh -huh, father. Is the father, father of Sam and Jim. Then Sam is Jumiko's husband. And his wife. Wife. Very right? Sam and his wife. Okay. Sam and his wife. Then we have Jim is the brother of uh, Sam and brother and what do we have here? Sister in law. Sister in law. Sister in law. Okay. Now. Do we have sister in law, right? Sister, sister in law. And then we have aunt and uncle. Uncle, okay. Donna and Manuel are aunt and uncle of who? And Teresa? We're about nice. to... Niece? Niece. Sure, niece. Okay, are here. Cousin. Oh, cousin. The cousin, yes, the cousin. Okay, it's the cousin. And then you have the... Kelly is niece. niece, okay, niece, not nice, right, niece, and then we have Jimmy is the nephew, okay? So this is the relation between these two guys here, the sister-in-law, and then you have the family. There are other members, right? There are some other members. But here, for example, we have Andy. Who's Andy? Andy's the little kid, right? No. Oh, Andy's the man. Okay, so Andy is Sam's what? Grandfather. And Marta is his? Grandmother. Mother. Grandmother, right? It's the grandmother. Okay, it's the grandmother. What about Chris? Chris is Sam's? Father. Chris is Sam's father. Okay, Sam's father. Okay, good. Manuel. Manuel is Sam's? Uncle. 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 Okay. Uncle. 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 Okay, good. And Sam is married to Jumiko. She is his? Wife. 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 Okay. Sam has a brother and he's married to Lisa. Then Lisa is Sam's sister in law. Sister in law. Okay. So here when we talk about the the in laws, okay, the in laws are all the family that we have in a Let's say the in-laws. Okay, so these are members that we get by the law. Okay, for example, uh, the wife, the sister, 
of my wife is my sister, but no, because of the blood, right? Not because of the same family. It's because of the law, okay? Because I am married to his sister, to her sister. So I have sister-in-law, father-in-law, mother-in-law. The father-in-law is the father of my wife. The mother in my mother-in-law is the mother of my wife. They are a family for lay, right? And then I guess that in Spanish, in Spanish we call them like a familia politica, right? Because we get them by law, not because, not por sangre, no, it's not sanguine, right? So that's the in-laws. Sister-in-law, I don't know why it says in-law. Okay. Then uh, there is a, Teresa is the daughter of Manuel. So she is Sam's? Cousin. Cousin. Okay, Sam's cousin. Okay, Sam's cousin. Okay. And Jim and Lisa have two babies, Kelly and Jim. Kelly is Sam's. Okay, yes. Okay, yes. Uh -huh. Kelly is Sam's miss. Okay, because uh, Sam and Sam and Jumiko don't have children, but Jim and Lisa they have children, right? So then these two children here, this is the niece of Sam and this is the nephew, okay? Sam's nephew. How se pronuncia, teacher? Niece. Niece. Okay. Niece. Yes, niece. Okay. Okay. And all of them are correct, right? So these are the family members. Some, right? Some of the family members. Remember that you have uh, plurals, right? Children, when we say hijos, right? So we have son and daughter, but then you have children. Okay, you have brother and sister, and you have siblings. Uh, you have father and mother, and then you have parents, the two. Grandfather, grandmother, and then you have grandparents. Okay, so they have also their own names, right? So then it says, look at the Sam's family tree. How are these people related to him? And then we answer the questions already. Then, ask and answer questions using the present continuous, okay? So what are the questions that we have to ask? Are you ready to study present continuous? I want you to play the audio program and follow us on the explanation. Before we begin, I want to remind you, present continuous is used for actions that are happening right now. With this in mind, let's listen. Present continuous. Are you living at home now? Yes, I am. No, I'm not. Is your sister working for the government? Yes, she is. No, she's not. No, she isn't. Are Ed and Jill going to college this year? Yes, they are. No, they're not. No, they aren't. Where are you working now? I'm not working. I need a job. What is your brother doing these days? He's traveling in the Amazon. Who are your parents visiting this week? They're visiting my grandmother. Again, it is important for you to recall the difference between these two tenses. Remember the simple present is used for habitual actions and present continuous is for actions that are happening right now. This is how we ask yes no questions in present continuous. Be plus subject plus verb, ing plus complement plus question mark. Read the example with me. 
Is she eating? Yes, she is. No, she's not. And to ask WH questions, we add the question word needed at the very beginning of it. Let's work it out. What is she eating? She's eating pizza. Note and never forget that we need the verb be plus ing for affirmative, negative, or questions when using the present continuous. So what are you doing right now? Type your answers in a discussion box. This is how we ask yes no questions. Parents visiting this week. They're visiting my grandma. Need a job. Okay. So we have always the <clears throat> the three, let's say the uh, three four forms. We have the affirm the affirmative sentence, right? You say I am speaking, I am working, and then uh, you have the yes no question. Is your sister working for the government? Uh, are Ed and Jill going to the to college this year? Where are you working now? And what is your brother doing these days? These are the information questions. Uh, in the first in the first part, the first uh, block of questions in just no questions, are you living at home now? Then you can answer yes I am or no I'm not. Is your sister working for the government? Yes, she is. No, she's not. And are Ed and Jill going to college this year? Yes, they are. On the, no, they're not. The information questions is a sentence. Where are you working now? I'm not working. I need a job. What is your brother doing these days? Okay, he's traveling in the Amazon. Who are your parents visiting this week? Okay, they're visiting my brother. What is your brother doing these days? He's traveling in the Amazon. Who are your parents visiting this week? They're visiting my grandmother. Again, it is important for you to recall the difference between these two tenses. Remember the simple present is used for habitual actions and present continuous is for actions that are happening right now. This is how we ask yes no questions in present continuous. Be plus subject plus verb, ing plus complement plus question mark. Read the example with me. Is she eating? Yes she is. No she's not. And to ask WH questions, we add the question word needed at the very beginning of it. Let's work it out. What is she eating? She's eating pizza. Note and never forget that we need the verb be plus ing for affirmative, negative, or questions when using the present continuous. So what are you doing right now? Type your answers in a discussion box. Okay, now in your um, in your in the chat, I want you to write two sentences. Okay, two sentences of what you are doing right now. Okay, for example, you can say I am a I don't know. Probably you can invent right because right now everybody's going to write the same. I'm understanding English. Okay, but you we are going to invent and they say I am watching a movie, okay? I am watching a movie. Okay, I am uh, I am chatting. Okay, now I'm gonna use another one. I am, uh, let's say, texting my, uh, let's say, my coworkers. my co-workers okay okay those are my two sentences okay now you write two sentences in the chat and after we're going to use those sentences to ask questions okay 
you're, cook you're cooking dinner. <clears throat> okay, I'm listening. I am listening to music. I am watching TV. No, no questions, Robert. Only sentences, affirmative sentences in this moment. Only sentences. Okay. Uh -huh, okay, I am reading the book. Yeah, I'm talking to my parents, okay. I am running, okay, good. Okay, I am running. Okay, running. Okay, so we have Floor, we have Edris, Robert, Carmina, and it is. Okay, good. Now that we have these questions, hey, I mean these sentences, then we can ask questions, right? For example, I can say, Floor, are you cooking dinner? Yes, I am. Yes, I am, okay. Are you watching TV for? No, I am not. No, I am not, okay. So you see, then I am using just the questions with the information that she gave, right? For example, uh, Beatrice, are you listening to the radio? No, I'm not. No, I'm not, okay. Are you talking to your friends? Are you talking to your neighbors? Yes, I am. Neighbors or parents? What? Neighbors or parents? Parents. Okay, are you talking to your neighbors? No, I'm not. No, I'm not. I That's... talk uh -huh. to my parents. I'm talking to my parents. Very good. Okay, uh, Iris, are you studying French? No. No? No, I am not. I am studying English. That's correct. Right? No, I am not. I'm studying English. Okay, I'm studying English. Good. And uh, let me see. Brenda, right, my brother. And you, Brenda? Can you say, I am? Okay, have to use sentence, I am. Okay, write a sentence with I am. Uh, okay. No, ya. Yeah. Eh, ¿cuál es la eh, discúlpe, cuál es la cuestión? Write. Write sentences about you. Describe oraciones de usted. I am. I am oh. writing, okay. okay. You say my brother is playing is playing with his friends. Then you can say uh -huh. I am and you? Ah, uh, yo. Ah, uh, yo lo puse así en tercera uh -huh. persona. You the person. Yes, you want you to use uh -huh. I am. Entonces I am lo the... La voy a corregir. Just write one, write one question only. Okay, one, one sentence. Escriba una oración only and that's it. Okay. Okay, no problem, no problem. Ahorita la corrijo. Sure, okay. sure, sure. No, that, that one is correct, okay? Eso está bien. My brother is playing with his friends. Then, uh, let me see, Carmina. Are you, are you, let me see, are you playing soccer? No, I am not. No, I am not, right? Then you can say, I am running. Okay, good. Then, uh, let's see, we're going to use, now we can practice with the questions 
uh, is he, is she. For example, we can say Robert is, um, let yes. me see, is Iris reading the newspaper? Look in the chat. Is Iris reading the newspaper? Mm. Yes, she is. Look in the chat says, I am reading a book. I am reading a book. Uh -huh. Then you say, No, she isn't. She is. No, she isn't. Okay. Uh -huh. No, she isn't. Is she reading a book? No, she is. Uh, for example, it is. is uh, let me see. Is Brenda, is Brenda cleaning the kitchen? Brenda. Brenda, I am, yes, yes, she, she. Yes, she is, right? They say, I am cleaning the kitchen. Brenda, cleaning the kitchen? Yes, she is. Okay, good. Uh, let's see, I'm um, taking, I'm um, no, taking, I'm talking to my parents. Who else? Oh, Beatrice here, okay. Uh, Flora, is Beatrice watching TV? Mm. No, she's not. She's talking with her parents. Okay, no, she's not. She's talking with her parents, okay? Then you can use that one. And what else? Uh, well, you have a, it is, you say, are you staying in English? Okay, good. Then, uh, now Carmina, you uh, let me see. The last question, is Brenda's brother playing with his friends? Is Brenda's brother playing with his friends? Uh, yes, they... Is Brenda's brother, only the brother. Oh. Is Brenda's brother playing with his friends? Uh, I don't, uh, uh, no, sir. <laughs> okay, yes, 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 you know. Okay, I'm going to put it in the chat again. Yeah. Hey, my brother is playing. Okay, look. So look at Brenda this. Okay. My brother is playing with his friends. Then I want to know about her brother, not the friends. Is Brenda's brother playing with his friends? He say yes. Yes. Yes, yes he is. Yes, uh-huh. Okay. Because we say in the in the question we say is Brenda's Look at this one, is Bren, it's in the R, is Brenda's brother, okay, playing with his friends. Okay. So then the question is, si el hermano de Brenda, right? Is Brenda's brother playing with the friends? Yes, he is. Okay. Good. So then now, uh, write two questions, but no, no in the chat, okay? This is not in the chat. This is, if you want in your, in your piece of paper or in your cell phone or whatever, uh, using are you, okay? And then you are going to ask the questions to, uh, to the group. For example, uh, I can say, Roberto, are you, are you working in this moment? Are you working? No, I'm not. 
No, I'm not. Uh, uh -huh. Yes. I am. Uh, I am. Class. Um, I, you can uh, say I am in class. I'm, I'm in class. Or you can say I am studying English, right? I am studying yeah. English or I am in class. I am in class. Okay, good. Then, um, Brenda, are you are you cooking in this moment? Are you cooking? No, I know. Okay. I am studying in English. I am studying English, right? Yes, I am studying English. Okay. Or you can uh, we can invent, right? You can invent. Podemos inventar otras respuestas to practice different verbs. Okay. No tiene que ser cierto. Uh, let's see. <laughs> Okay. So, so that we can practice, we can say, Beatrice, are you, a, let's see, are you texting, are you texting a, your friends? No, I am not. Okay. No, I am not. Then you only answer, no, I'm not. And if you want, si ustedes quieren dar una respuesta más larga, then you say, no, I am not, I am a... For example, I am reading, I am watching TV, I am uh, uh, preparing my my clothes for tomorrow, I am ironing, estoy planchando, right? I am ironing, I don't know, you can invent, okay? Two questions, ready? Okay, Flora ask the question to Robert. One question. Okay. Robert, are you doing exercise? Good question. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Perfect. Okay, Robert, ask Iris. Uh, Iris, are you traveling, traveling now? Traveling. Mm -hmm. Traveling now? No, I am not. Okay, good. Nice, you're practicing different verbs, excellent. It is ask a question to Beatrice. How are you? Um, Beatrice, you, no, are you, are you, are you, are you, um, are you, um, cleaner, you ha you help? Are you cleaning your house? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Okay, Beatrice, ask Brenda. Okay. Are you cooking pizza? Ooh, are you baking, uh, making pizza? No, I am. Not. No. No, I am not. I know. No, no, I'm I'm, no, I'm not. Okay. okay, Brenda, ask the question to Carmina. Uh, ay, pero ¿qué es que cambió? ¿Qué pasó? Are you uh, listening to music? Yes, I am. Okay, good. Now, Carmina, ask Flora. Um, are you cooking now? No, I am not. No, I am not. Okay, good. Now, Flor, now you choose a victim. It is. It is. Are you washing the dishes? Okay, good. Yes, I am. Perfect. It is. You choose another victim. Excuse me? Choose a victim, select a victim from the group. <laughs> no, 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 um, Billy, veo que hay un Billy. Okay. Ask the question. 
Billy, um, are you, are you, ay, se le van los verbos, por <laughs> Are you playing soccer? Playing soccer? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Okay, good. All right, Billy, now you choose a victim. Um, Robert, so Robert, we, is, uh, Robert is like this. <laughs> Robert. Robert uh -huh. Quijano. Yes. Mm -hmm. Is Robert Quijano a practice the platform? Okay, Robert, are you are you, are you practicing with the pla with the platform? The uh, platform. Yeah, yes, I am. <laughs> okay, yes, I am. Okay, good. Okay, Robert, choose somebody, choose a person to victimize. Okay, victimize somebody. Difficult. <laughs> a no, difficult one. No. Um, uh, how do we say in Spanish? Una yuca. <laughs> okay. Oh, no, fácil. Okay. Uh, Brenda, are you playing piano? Are you playing? Uh, playing are you playing the, the piano? No, I know. No, I am not. Okay. Are you playing the piano? No, I am not. Hey, that's a good question. Playing the playing musical instruments. Okay, good. Uh, Brenda. Um. And Flor, are you taking a shower? Taking. <laughs> taking a shower? Yes, I am. <laughs> okay, good. Wow. It's very cold. <laughs> no, it's cold right now. Okay, yeah. good. Um, Carmina, ask a question. Um, uh, 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 alguien? Yes. A quien usted quiera. Oh. You select. Um, a Beatriz. Okay, Beatriz. Ready. Shoot. Are you watching TV? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Okay, good. The last question, Beatriz. You ask the last question. Mm. Para Brenda. Okay, Brenda. Are you riding a, har a horse? Yes, I am. Are you riding a horse? <laughs> yes, I am. Okay, like a cow, like a cowgirl, right? A okay. cow. Yes. Quiero okay. ver. Tengo que elegir otro. Yeah, choose another one. Okay. Um, Billy, are you I sleeping? <laughs> My goodness, are you sleeping? <laughs> no, I am sleeping. Uh, oh, there's another one. No, 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 it's okay, it's okay. Ah, okay. Ahorita voy, ahorita voy. No. Oh. no, no, it's not. No, I am no, not. not. No, no, I, I am not. not. Yes. Are you sleeping? I am. Um, I am. <laughs> I am a work uh, computer. I am working. Working. Uh -huh, okay, I'm working my computer. Okay, I'm working. A computer. The okay. computer. Okay. And the computer. Okay. Yes. Good. Excellent. Okay. Good. Then uh, these are just no questions. You saying are you? Is he? Is she? Right. So then you can see the different answer. Yes, I am. Okay, but it's important. From Teacher, me, solo, yes, Robert. Una pregunta. Siempre que ocupamos entonces el present continuum, siempre le, al verbo le vamos a agregar ing. No es regla general, verdad? Pero no, no yes. Sí va a ser. No, yes, it is. Oh, sí. Sí, ah, es, okay. In this case, yes. Siempre okay. vamos a usar el ing. You should be missing. Are you? Listening to me, okay, always, right? Are you? 
Are you listening? Uh, is he listening? Always you're going to use ING form. And la otra regla es que es en el ING say, for example, that you use the verb to be. Am, um, is, are. Siempre tiene que ir acompañado de eso. Okay. I am working. You are working. She is working. Okay. Uh, I am, uh, I am, uh, let's say, uh, I am drinking soda. You are drinking soda. He is drinking soda. She is drinking soda. And in the question. Uh -huh. Excuse me. Y si una pregunta siempre empieza con R, eh, eh, es respuesta corta, pero si empezamos, no. si utiliza, no siempre, o si utilizamos este, por ejemplo, what, who y todas esas, es de información. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Okay. Are you, uh, let's say, are you, let me see, are you, are you, are you brushing? Y se puede utilizar el ING con la doble H. Haciendo pregunta con doble H y utilizando el ING o no. Yes. Yes. Yes, no problem. Por ejemplo, no. eh, look at this one. Are you brushing your teeth? Ok. This question is, are you brushing your teeth? Uh, you can say, yes, I am, okay? Or then you can say, you can say, no, I am, no, I am not. Okay, y aquí puede dar extra information if you want, Robert. No, I am mm. not, I am. Uh, eating, I am eating a mango. Okay. You see? Are you brushing okay. your teeth? They said, no, I'm not. I'm eating a mango in this moment. Okay. But uh, that extra information is only if you want to, because the question is just no. And then you can say, no, I'm not. Okay. But if I ask you, what are you? Doing. Okay, I keep it, sir. What are you doing in general, or what are you doing right now? Mm -hmm. And then, aquí sí, I am. Aquí no me decir, yes, I am, or no, I'm not. Then you say, I am. A, what? I am a, probably cleaning. Cleaning uh, my cell phone. Okay. Por, por ejemplo, teacher, puedo mm -hmm. decir, are you living at San Salvador? Are you living in? In San yes. Salvador. Mm -hmm. Yes. Then you, puedo pregu puedo preguntar, tam puedo preguntar también, who are you living in San Salvador? Um, no. Uh -huh. eh, eh, si quiere ser who, eh, le faltaría algo. I say, are you living in San Salvador? Then you say, yeah, no, I'm not. Okay, no, I am not. I am living in Lourdes. Okay? Pero si usted dice, are you living in San Salvador? Yo solo le digo, no, I'm not. Okay? Pero si yo uh -huh. quiero, le puedo dar la extra. And then I say, I am living in San Salvador. Ahora, who is king? Entonces usted mm -hmm. dice, who are you living in San Salvador? ¿Quién vive? Uh, entonces sería, who are you living with? Mm -hmm. Ok, ahí esa pregunta tiene que agregarle el with at the end. Who are you living with? Okay, yes, it is con quien vives. Uh -huh. Okay, who are you okay. living? Now you can ask you. where, okay, no problem. Where are you? Where are you living? And I'm write a capital. Where are you living? Okay. 
Okay. Who are you living with? Where are you living? Uh, where are you working? Where are you working now? Why? Why are you uh, studying? Why are you studying English? Okay. Why are you studying English? Podría ser, what are you reading? What are you, leyendo? yeah, what are you reading? What are you reading? What are? What are, what are you are. reading? Okay. What are you reading? Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. See, all these questions, who, what, where, why. Okay, uh, how many? How many books are you reading? A year. Okay, how many books are you reading a year? One, two, three, four, five books. I am reading four books a year. I am reading five books a year. I am reading six books a year. Okay, so all the questions. And if you see always, you are always using the ING form. Okay. Okay, always. And the verb to be. Am, is, are. Ah, vamos a una comis para... Let me see. Who, what, where. When. When is she coming to El Salvador? When is she coming to El Salvador? Okay, cuando viene ella, right? When is she... Okay, let me see, another one. Why is she learning math? Porque está aprendiendo matemáticas ella, right? Why is she? Okay, you see, we use when is, what are you, when are you, okay, what am I doing? What am I doing? Que hago yo? Que estoy haciendo yo, right, in this moment? So always, verb to be, ing. Okay, here um, the 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 limit is uh -huh. when. Okay, I have an error. This one, wait a minute. Mm. Yes, when is she? This is the correct. When is she coming to El Salvador? Okay, faltaba el she. Okay. Uh, then, for example, you can ask a question, uh, Flor, why are you studying English? Because it's important. Okay. In, in this case, uh, when you say, why are you studying English? The answer is your purpose or your reason. Aquí va a ser su propósito o su razón, right? For example, because it is important for my job. Es una razón. Okay, or un propósito, to get a better job. Para conseguir un mejor trabajo. To. Okay, it's just a, to get a better job. No necesariamente en ING. Okay, because it's un propósito o una razón. Or because I am trying to change my job. Okay, estoy tratando de cambiar el trabajo. Okay, or because I am looking for a uh, better position in my job, okay? So then these are the different uh, possibilities in the answer. 
Okay, Beatriz, why, what, uh, why are you learning English? Or why are you studying English? <clears throat> because I moved to USA soon and I need English. Okay, because I am moving to the United Move. States soon and I need English. Okay, because I am moving. Me voy a cambiar, me voy a trasladar, me voy a... Okay, I'm aware, right? Because yeah. I am moving to the United States soon and I need it. Okay, good. That's a good uh, reason. Uh, it is, why are you learning English? Oh. I... I need I need help my my son for a student okay. and, and and I need um, I ¿cómo se dice aprender? I need mm. to learn. I need to learn. Okay. I need to help my son to study and I need to learn. Okay? Those son propósitos, uno personal y uno para su, right? I need to help my son and I need to learn English, okay? Good. And who else? Uh, Robert, why are you learning English? Because I travel a lot to the United States Perfect. and it is necessary to know English. Okay, you see? Why are you learning English? Excellent. Okay. And Jubilee? Why are you learning English? We lost Billy for a second. Okay, and Carmina, why are you learning English? Uh, because it's very important uh, um, uh, no sé cómo decir para ayudarle a mi primo. Okay, to help my cousin. Uh, to help my cousin. Uh -huh, to, help, to help my cousin. Okay, that's correct. So these are, you know, some things that, uh, some reasons, right? We, or purposes we have to do something. Okay, any okay. questions? about the ing and the this art you know you see for example how to make only affirmative sentence or negative sentences you say i am not uh, just no questions are you is he or is she is he uh, is he talking to me is he looking at me okay uh, is he writing a letter okay is he walking is he cleaning the car? Is he driving his car? Is he, uh, is he paying his credit card? Is he paying his debts? Is he earning a lot of money? Is he working? Okay, so then these are just no questions. And the, well, in the information questions, all the ones they have, where are you living in this moment? Uh, where are you working now? You may say, I am working in the same company. Or I am, uh, I am looking for a job. Okay. They say, I am not, uh, where are you working now? Well, I am not working in this moment. I am looking for a job. Okay. So then always try to use different, different verbs, right? So that we can practice and remember the vocabulary, to keep the vocabulary in our mind. Okay, people. Como se portaron super bien, yo cumplo mis promesas, mañana no le voy a dar clase. Okay, mañana lo voy a dejar descansar, porque okay. Flor se va a ir de party, Brenda también, okay. <laughs> so, ahí si quieren, que okay. bien, como todos están en Metapan, ¿verdad? Thank you, teacher. Yeah, okay, tienen chance de venir a San Salvador. Now, okay. Eh, a Santana, okay. All right, Santana. so then, eh, then we'll see you on Monday, tomorrow no class, right? So Monday, the next uh, week, we finish. Pónganse el día con la, 
plataforma que ya solo nos quedan un par de días. La otra semana vamos a tener mucha más eh, práctica oral, ¿ok? Como ahora. Okay. ¿Cuándo finaliza, dicho? El próximo jueves, justo el jueves. Exactamente ese jueves tiene oh. que tener todo terminado, ¿ok? Oh, Así yeah. que vamos a ver si hacemos una revisión del examen el jueves, el miércoles, perdón, para que ya el jueves ya puedan tenerlo terminado. Teacher. Yes, sir. Fíjese que solo tengo yo problemas con la, con la 4.4. Ah, ok. No la encontré. Hay, hay unas, ahí, ahí lo puse en el chat. Va, hay como dos, dos interrogantes que no, no las pude resolver. Va, ya lo vamos a ver después de otra clase. Yo les he eh, hecho la mano ahí. Ok. Bueno. Bye, bye. bye. Ok, see you Monday. Okay, see teacher. you Monday. Okay. Have a good night. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night.